Time for a little leopard, ladies. I'm Laura Ray, and today I have so many great Amazon finds to share with you, including these shoes. I like a pop of leopard. I think it's so cute. I also am a fan of this style of shoe. My feet don't bother me, and they're just so super cute. I like a touch of leopard, so I'll wear jeans, a plain shirt, and then a pop on the feet. Now, I'm also loving this pumpkin shirt. I'm hiding it from you here, sitting here. You can't see it as well, but it is so cute for fall. I like just something that has a little bit of a statement but not necessarily words printed on the front so when i saw this pumpkin i thought oh that's perfect i heard a hairstylist talk about wearing a silk cap to bed to keep from your hair getting all out of shape while you're sleeping so i bought this beautiful silk cap and i've been wearing this to bed at night and it really does help keep the style so if you're like me and you just want to wake up with your hair a little more like it was when you went to bed, you might want to try a silk cap. Chris Gibson is a skincare expert here on YouTube. He's written books. He has been on many talk shows. Well, he has a YouTube channel and I'll link that below. But I heard Chris talk about this, this vitamin C plus AHA resurfacing peel. He went on and on how it would make you look like you had fresh new skin. So I was a little reluctant at first to try it because of my skin being so sensitive, but I thought I'll give it a shot because Chris was really pushing it, saying how great it was. So I purchased it. Oh my gosh, he is so right. I love the look of my skin even more, and I never thought I would say this, than my gommage. My gommage has been the go-to for getting rid of the surface skin and my skin looking fresh. I would say this is a step above that. This is a two-step mask that only takes two minutes. For step one, you apply this to clean, dry skin. And this is like granules, and you just, I take it, put it on the tips of my fingers and just lightly sort of buff the skin. This is step two. You can leave this on for up to a minute and it dissolves the crystals. All of a sudden it goes from the orangey shade to white and it just turns from granules to completely smooth and then you rinse the face. Wow, it is amazing. I've used it now, I think, four times, and I feel like it has improved the look of my skin so much. This is a big moment right now because I'm going to show you now my favorite sunscreen I've ever owned. I can't believe this. It was love at first application. It's from Misha, and it's their soft finish sun milk. It's a 50 plus sunscreen. What I love about this is the way it looks on my skin and the way it feels. So it goes on with this milky sort of pink texture. It didn't leave a strong white cast on my skin, which I really liked. But as I rubbed it in, it had a soft luminosity to it and it turns silky. So then my skin went from uh, feeling like you had a sunscreen to almost the feel of a soft powder. Right now, what I like about it, it does have a little bit of a blurring effect because of the color. So it just looked really great on my skin. I felt like I would go out even with just this on and without makeup because it really made my skin look nice. Now it doesn't have color in it like my one from La Roche-Posay that I love so much. This is so much cheaper and I love the way this feels even more on my skin. So this is now my number one sunscreen. One of my subscribers had said, will you review the DHC line of products? I haven't heard anybody talking about it and I'm very curious about it. Well, I had ordered some back in June. I ordered a travel set because it had several products I could try out. So I've been using those and I'm gonna order some full size. But one thing I did love, I ordered two of, they come in a pack of two, DHC lip cream. 
Now, this is a lip balm. There's no color to it, but it is so hydrating. It gets great reviews. Lots of people were saying it left their lips feeling very moisturized all day. When I wore this without any lipstick on top, my daughter said to me, your lips look like they have a filler in them. And I said, it's that DHC lip cream making them look really smooth and full. So if you're thinking of trying maybe a new lip balm for fall coming up, we're going to have drier weather, then I say give this a try. I found a brand I'd never tried before on Amazon that was supposed to be a clean beauty brand. And that's what their whole brand is based around. And it's Karen Murrell. And I wanted to try her lipstick. So instead of ordering one lipstick, I ordered this nude palette. I know so many of you love nude lipsticks. I love mixing lipsticks. So that's why this really appealed to me. Now this was a higher price point, I think around $24.99. But I thought if I'm getting five shades that I can mix, then it would be worth it. Plus, I like the packaging. I, this is hard to find anymore. You can't find these lip palettes. I know Maybelline made one a few years ago, but this has a mirror, a brush. It's nice to take with you on the go. So I'm enjoying this. The lipsticks were creamy. They're not super long lasting. So I do want to tell you that if you're looking for a long lasting lipstick, this isn't it, but on her site, she says, this leaves out all the nasties, some ingredients that she's not fond of in lipstick. Now, I also ordered the lip pencil, and I really like this because it comes with a little lip brush on the end. And again, I ordered a nude shade. Cordovian Natural is the shade that I ordered. And I think it's a nice nude for every day, mixing with other lipsticks that I have. So what I've been doing since these lipsticks aren't super long lasting is I'll go in first with the lip pencil, fill in, and then apply the lipstick. I love that they're all creams. They look really pretty on mature skin and mature lips. And I think if you're looking for some new nude lipstick to try, you might enjoy it. I found this brand on Amazon. It's called Soda. And again, I thought these were so retro cute. I needed some shoes that were like a camely color. I like that it's got the rope. I think that's a great detail. And the little grommets here on the side, I think that's what they're called, grommets. But... I think these are adorable. They go great with jeans, so many things that I already own. So I'm really loving wearing these. If you have any Amazon finds you'd like to share with me, do it in the comments below. I love reading the comments and so do all of our subscribers here. If you're not subscribed to the channel, make sure you do because I don't want you to miss any videos. I've got some great stuff coming up. And uh, also, if you'd like to enter this week's giveaway for the sponge, just leave a comment. I would love it if you'd leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Thanks so much for watching. I love you all so much, and I'll see you soon.